And have you ever wondered what happens when a cryptocurrency exchange decides to stop supporting a stable coin? Well, that's exactly what happened to USDC on the Tron network. On March 25th, Binance announced that it plans to discontinue support for USD coin on the Tron network. Uh, starting from April 5th at 2 o'clock, the exchange will no longer uh, support deposits and withdrawals of USDC via the TRC20 standard. However, deposits and withdrawals of USDC via other supported networks, e.g. Ethereum, will not be impacted. And the decision to discontinue support for USDC on Tron was the result of an enterprise-wide approach that involved the business organization, compliance, and other functions across Binance's company. Circle, the issuer of USDC, had already announced earlier in February that it plans to end support for its token on Tron by February 2025. As a press time, data from USDC Cool, a platform tracking USDC across multiple blockchains indicates that over $172 million worth of liquidity is locked in USDC on Tron, accounting for 0.54% of the total supply. This figure surpasses liquidity locked in other networks such as Polygon, $168 million, and Optimism, $118 million. Uh, and it's worth noting that Binance has allocated approximately $1.7 million in USDC, representing about 0.01% of its token allocations on the Tron network. New Mile, a significant portion of Binance's asset center, Tier C20 Holdings, valued at over $13.5 billion, is allocated in Tether, constituting 98.2% of its holdings on the network. In conclusion, while the discontinuation of USDC support on Tron may seem like a minor detail, it highlights the ever-changing nature of the cryptocurrency market. As such, it's important for to stay up to date with the latest developments in the industry to make informed investment decisions. Uh, and with that said, thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.